Alrighty, so let's go ahead and switch over to my Siege deck. I got special permission from the guild to do something fun today. Was it this deck? It's this deck. So we're gonna be doing an all mythic deck, baby. We're gonna be doing all mythic characters. Unfortunately, I don't have enough mythic items to run a full deck for that, so I do have to use some legendaries, but I am running every mythic item that I do have. So it's every possible combination I can run for mythics to still make this a workable deck. Should be fun. This week in Siege, we're going up against Sushi Bender. We've already dropped three of their islands. The guild's currently working on trying to take Drunk. I'm going to be hitting Hyper Island here, though, because we're doing that all mythic deck, baby. Got special permission from the guild to attempt this. So we're just going for wins. Here we go. <laughs> we got Sully Man up first. Leads with the Mythic Peter. I like it. He's on my level with the Mythic game. I'm feeling you, Sully. I'm feeling you. Oh my god, there's not a freaking item. Are you kidding me? God damn it! Alright. I'm running, um, all of my items besides the Mythics are Fighter, because they have the hardest hitting combos for me for this deck. So we're gonna go Peter, because I got that Combo Mastery 3 Chicken Fight. Oh, where's the item? What the fuck? Okay. Um. Could you Meat Man for the Bodyguard to protect? I think that's the way to go, because we can also hijack the cheer. Come on, give me the item. If I lose if I lose this match because I have no items to play, I'm going to be slightly tilted. Okay, Cuddles. Not the item I wanted, but honestly, I think I might need to do that. Actually, you know what? No. I'm going to go ahead and just go for Dog Bone Stan, I think, is the way. If I miss what I need. We're going to lead Cuddles. I would rather have the Chicken Fight than the um, Dolphin Rider. Because Dolphin Rider, that combo is garbage, in my opinion. There's a reason it's the freebie one they give you. There we go. There's my chicken fight. Look at that, baby. Look at that. Combo Mastery 3. Golden chicken fight. That sexy beast. Give me the punch on Peter. I need that thing to die. Ah, I missed it. Oh, well, at least we're still in this, and I can go ahead and make Dog, uh, dog Bone stand up next. They drop the zap. Um, ooh, we got Bob. We could go for Squirrel Death and actually heal up that first slot. That's actually going to be the smarter way to do this, to stay in this, I think. Actually, that's leaving too much to RNG, because if I lose the slot there, I'm kind of boned. If it doesn't get me the right heals, I think Dogbone's better. We're going to get a round of Craze in there, and we get a Cripple that could help out. We're going Dogbone. Because I've, I've learned a valuable lesson, if it's anything, over these last few years playing this game. If you leave anything up to RNG, Jesus, he'll rape you. He'll rape you good. <sighs> oh, man. Okay, we got the kill there, so look at that. It worked out. We got the win. So let's lead out there with the mythic. What's my highest mythic here? Technically, it's Stewie, so we're going to throw that baby out to the wolves. That's a win. Hell yeah. Trent saying went up against a CM3 off BGE chicken fight today in Secret Fight Club. So basically, it was an insta loss since you have no love from RNG. Welcome to my life, Trent. <laughs> uh, Rick Leck asks, what's my strongest battleground effect? That would be hands down art. Actually, I don't know. It's a toss-up. It's Art and Fighter. I definitely have a great Fighter deck with the Combo Mastery 3. For um, for a Chicken Fight, I can run a whole deck of that. But, that being said, I do have a really great Art deck as well. Let's lead Stan, and I want to see how we're going to do this. Hey, what you got against Art, Vux? Don't be going ew. All right, they got Cuddles there. I'm kind of feeling the Mascot Fighter, to be honest. We could go for Clarinet. Um, just to keep that thing alive, but I'm digging Mascot Fighter. It's got a lot of potential for damage there, so let's go ahead and just do that. Uh, got a good punch. Payback should help kill it. I do need to play catch up a bit now, though. Let's go ahead and do... Ooh, I like Hip Hop Bob as a potential there. I'm gonna do Nibbler. I know they might be making something with Fart School Jimmy Jr. there, but whatever. Ooh, and they hit me with Duke. That's nasty. That's going to hurt. All right, let's get Hip Hop Bob made. Get that cripple all in that craze train flowing. Try to commit to as many mythics on the field as I can. So go ahead and do Luis next. Keep the mythic dream alive. It's not the smartest move, but hey, I'm going for it. We have a little bit of wiggle room. I'm not completely boned yet. Come on, baby. Drop the slot. RC Helicopter, that just gave me the win. So, field full of mythics. Hell yeah. Uh, ZM, thanks. What's my favorite combo out of all BGEs? 
Oh, that is tough, man. There's so many combos. That is hard. Um, I mean, Sig Addicts, of course, is fun because of how strong and OP it is, but I feel like that's the easy answer. That is a tough one, dude. <sighs> Let me get back to you on that. Let me think on that because that actually is a really tough one. There's so many combos. After we finish on the Siege here, I'll go and look through my inventory and take a quick, quick look at that for you. Let's go ahead and throw this out. <laughs> Vux says Jaso is a cock lover. He's going for the chicken fight. <laughs> Someone's been reading the old wog chats when we all joke about cock. Actually, I think it's one of my old videos when I had fighter up there. I actually think there was a clip. There actually is a clip online of me saying wog loves cock. <laughs> Let's go ahead and lead out there with Dog Bone Stan with Cuddles. ALM. Yeah, uh, another Lousy Millennium is also a great one. I don't have the cards to make it, so I never really run it. Ooh, I'm glad we went Dog Bone Stan. That, that brainwashed Haley actually hurt. Fuck. Um, I need the right punches to land her. I'm kind of boned. I'm going to go ahead and get Chicken Fight set up for those bombs to deal with that thing. So let's go ahead and do Brian the Home Invader. Watch it make the chicken fight first and just end my entire career right here. Watch it happen. At least I got the cripple that I needed. Okay, went for the combo, but not what I thought it would do. Thank God. All right. Chicken fight. Boom. Don't even care if I should have been doing Peggy instead. I just wanted to get that combo out. God, maybe Vux is onto something. Maybe it is chicken fight. <laughs> All righty. Let's throw out... Let's throw out Dr. Zoidberg. I feel like I don't ever play him that much. And there's the win. Hell yeah. Sorry, Doug Nug. Who we got next? Next up, we got... Ambigs. Oh, I see someone said One Man Musical. Trent was saying that was their favorite. It's also another really good one. It's also a really popular one, though, which is why I didn't immediately name it. I'm trying to pick a more obscure combo that I would really like for different reasons. I am not a fan of either of these. Jesus. I am a fan of that, though. I think that's how we're playing this. Let's go ahead and do the item, just in case I get a better character. Did not get the better character, so brainwashed Haley it is. Please punch the toad licking. Uh, Vux has got a soft spot for Billionaire Fry. It was the first box he ever spent on. Yeah, that's understandable to have a soft spot for a combo if it's the first one you went hard in on. That's kind of why I really like Chicken Fight. It was the first box I completely bought out twice. <laughs> back in the back at the time, it seemed like a good idea, but um, yeah, in hindsight, it probably wasn't the best one to dump all that money into. Um, am I gonna drop Junkie Peggy? Not off the bat, I won't. But Brian Statue definitely will. So let's go ahead and get some motivate in there. I think a better box at the time if I would have went hard in on the um, Cartel, not Cartel class, Whiskey Bartender would have been a great box to buy out. That pre-combo never goes out of style. Ooh, Medicated Stewie, I'm digging that. I'm also digging Xerxes. We'll go ahead and lead with Hypnotoad. Uh, is it over? Not yet, but might as well just keep playing Mythics. You know what? I have pretty good control of the field. Let's just see how many Mythics we can play out now. Unless I lose Haley, there's no point to really combo. And we got Luis, it's over here. So let's get another Mythic on the field. And we got four out this time. I forget what my record is. It's in one of my older YouTube videos. I Whatever my record is, it was like five or six, I think, for most Mythics on the field before we just absolutely ended the game. So let's see how many we can get out for this um, stream. Do I think it's just going to be a clash, or do I think it's going to be a Jimmy Jr. challenge like with the Zap one? That's a tough call. Um, I would love to see an actual challenge like they had before, but I do know after the debacle with the Zap one, they went on record saying that they wanted to work on it and fix a few issues with it before they brought those back. So I feel like it would be a regular sort of clash. Then again, by nature, clashes aren't really having to do with, the, um, with those... Um, particular combos like that so they might bring it back maybe they perfected the formula Ooh, sig addicts that's kind of the way i want to take it um we'll go ahead and make bakaneko fighter first just to have the protection there and then we're going to go and get sig addicts made thank god they didn't sig addicts me back um let's go ahead and do peggy 
And Mythic Sig Addicts Combo Mastery 2. I need that thing to come back in the shop before Addicted comes. I only need to buy it one more time and then I get Combo Mastery 3. Oh God, look at that thing. It's so hard for that not to be my favorite combo. 37 Gas, 37 Leech, 21 Craze. It's so broken. I love it. It is the easy choice, though, so I'm not going to say it's my favorite combo as much as I love it. <laughs> as disgusting as it is. Uh, Z my THXX, what box should I save up for? That's a tough call. Without actually seeing the boxes, I can't predict the future. I don't have any sort of partnership with Kong where they tell me what's coming out ahead of time. Be dope if they did, but not officially partnered with them on anything, so I find out as soon as you guys do. If I ever see one in the store, though, I might do a review if I have the time. I know somebody was asking me in a YouTube comment to do a review for Addicted, and I let them know that if we have the time, we'll go ahead and do it. All depends on my schedule. Let's go ahead and just make Chicken Fight. And let's just start, start spamming the Mythics. There's four. Can this go another turn? Damn it. I honestly didn't need to combo there. I probably could have kept this going and got five out on the field. Okay, reminder to myself, this next match, if I have the chance, we're going to try to get five Mythics on the field. Uh, let's see here. Who we got? We got Josh Matiske, Dr. Zoidberg, meet me on the field of that Mythic. I like it. Crack Attic Stan. Eh, not bad. I'm going to lead with Stan. Okay, I do want to get a combo made, so probably going to waste a Mythic here and just get Crack Attic so we have a Crazer. And then we're going to start building out a Mythic Wall. Do I need Motivate? No, I should be good. So let's go ahead and do probably Nibbler because it has Leech. Actually, we'll do Stewie. He has more Leech and more HP. If I'm going to try to build out this wall, he is the smarter move. Oh, they got Claw Plock. I actually can't afford to keep playing down the line here. I think I need to make a combo. I need to make a combo, to be honest, because I'm going to lose otherwise. Karate Stewie, get in there. Next up, we got Cuddles for Princess Piddles, or we got Fart School. Not a fan of either of those, really. I'll lead with the Nibbler, as I feel like I have other characters that'll work well for the combos if I draw them. Oh, God damn it! it hit me hard. It hit me really hard there. Um, Luis to block. Okay, we're still in this. I think Stewie ends it here, so let's go ahead and just throw out another Mythic on the field. Let's go ahead and do That's My Parfait. So this time we got three Mythics on the field. Step down from before. Still got the win, though, which is what it's all about. Pretty sure the guild would be pissed if I was taking losses doing this, because they wanted everybody to hit drunk. But I said, no, you guys wanted to see Mythic gameplay. We're doing Mythic. And that only really works on the Hyper Island as long as there's no Hyper trait, which Kong should be releasing that soon. I would think it's the only one left, unless they bring out another new thing like they did with toys. Dogbone Stan, easy choice. We're going to lead with Stan. There's Dogbone. And now let's build that mythic wall. I want to build a fort. A golden fort. With blackjack and hookers. You know what? Forget the golden fort. I'll catch you guys later. <laughs> Just kidding. There's Bob. Eh, we only got three out that time. Still a win, though. What do we got next? We have three more hits. We're still flawless. Doug Nug up next. Leads with the Peter. Oh, we got some great options this time. We got Space Honey, Free Weed Haley, and then of course the fighter options. I'm gonna go ahead and lead with Leela. She might be able to handle her herself, honestly, if I leave her alone. Could do cats. You know what? I'm gonna do cats just because of that cripple all. That'll give me time to actually build out a card wall of mythics here. Let's see how many mythics we can get on the field. So we got that. Let's go ahead and do. Do I wanna do Haley for the motivate? Um yeah, let's do that. And we also got the bodyguard. So Peter should be falling. Okay, they comboed. I actually need to combo now, unfortunately. If I leave that unchecked, I will lose. So we got to make free weed Haley. Doug Nug just had to go and make the combo and spoil the fun. Just had to spoil my mythical fun. 
Alrighty, let's go ahead and do Brian Statue for some more Motivate there. Should be fine. Should get another round of Hijack. I get to live. Should get the kill easy on it. Yep, we barely held on, but we got it. Throw Dr. Zoidberg out there, because he's my golden boy. We got Peter. Is it over here? Um, it's not over, but I can afford to take the hit, so there's four Mythics on the field. <laughs> Dang it, if we had another card besides Brian's statue, we could have had five. All right, bye, Haley. Thanks for hanging in there, babe. <laughs> All right, there's another Mythic. We'll throw it out on the field there. Four Mythics, still at that record there. But hey, we got five cards deep that time. Who we got up next? We got... Joker for life. Leads with the Mythic Peter. All right, we got options. Got hip hop. Could also go for Christmas punch out. I'm gonna lead with Bob, because I see myself going that direction. What happens if we go for Fighter? I mean, it's great. But I think I would rather have Hip Hop for the um, Cripple All. Okay, they comboed to stay in it. I am down with that. Let's go ahead and do Cuddles, because it'll live the longest. Hopefully. Can it take another hit? Not really. I need to combo again. Doghouse Bobby, not bad, but I think Dog Bone is the way to go to be safe here. Okay, next up we're gonna do That's My Parfait. <laughs> Gotta keep a close eye on health here, because I can't afford to lose a card or I'll possibly lose. But if I ride that razor wire just right, we can try to expand this out. What are they gonna block with? Damn it, you should have blocked with something high HP. Alright, that's my win. That's gonna be four again. So there's Bobby onto the field there. This is like my new personal like just challenge. Try to get five freaking mythics on the field and still win. I could easily do it if we would sacrifice the win, but what's the point? Psycho Badger's up next. Leaves with the Bobby. Um, what do we got for items here? Class Spanker, Jealous Bobby. We are going probably Jealous Bobby, so we're gonna leave Bobby. Got Groin Kicker too, but let's do Jealous Bobby for the craze. What's the best legendary card? There are way too many legendary cards to answer that, dude. I mean, as far as pre combos go, you can narrow it down, but if you're just talking just straight up legendary card, like for items and characters, there's way too many. It depends on the battleground effect, the buffs they're getting. There's no definitive answer on that. Um, let's do Stewie. Come on, keep blocking. God. Damn it, I think it's over before we get another card out there. Peggy. Yep, we're going to be capped out at four Mythics again here. So that's that's the record for the stream, four Mythics. But hey, we went 10 for 10 in Siege using a wacky home Mythic deck, so that was fun. We got some more Rumble matches to come up here on stream, but for those of you watching at home on YouTube later, hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already.